What's going on, peeps? Joshua here, and it is Broken Tibia Day 38. Woo! Yeah! And today, I want to provide y'all how I have dealt with the dreaded shower challenge by the grace of the good Lord Jesus Christ. So it took me four days of prayer and fasting, and the Lord revealed to me how I shall deal with this challenge. And it's actually kind of a spawn off from how I dealt with the uh, back surgery last year. So I wasn't standing in the shower. And as you can see, straight away, there's a cooler right there. So two major ingredients make this happen is having something that can rest inside the tub basin there. So you can sit on that, especially if it's, you know, right around here at the height of the side of the tub. And then of course, having one of these. That is absolutely critical. Now, I am going to go ahead and show you how I managed to do this. And how I avoid getting any water on the cast. So number one, of course I, get situated on my commode here and I take said crutches and I lean them up over here boom boom this actually has water in it to help you know keep it from shifting around too much sort of sort of like a ballast weight and uh, now I highly recommend not just putting it on the tub peeps unless you are really good because yes, you could, you know, slip and boom, bam, plow. That would probably hurt, not feel good, peeps, not feel good. So do use caution with all of this, all right? You don't wanna get injured any more than you already are. Now, what I'll then do is, after of course I've unrobed, I will slide over here onto the side of the tub and then onto the cooler. Now, of course, last year I used this when I had the back surgery because it kept me from having to stand in the shower and take any risks. And that's why I used this and I used the same maneuver to shift over. Now, this is critical, of course. What you do is you bring your foot in here, but this is the most important part. You don't wanna get this wet. So what I do is keep your towel close by that you'll be using to dry off with. I take it. Keep it, you know, folded over as such, and then wrap around. And of course, this isn't gonna work for everybody. Some folk have the super Excelsior long cast on, you know, and it just, you'll have to try and figure it out. But so my cast ends about right here. This allows coverage, you know, right here. And of course, here in just a moment, I'll show you the method that also offers the rest of the protection so my cast is up here and you know i just take the shower curtain at which point bring it in drape the bottom over it over the towel you know in front of the towel there and boom done of course you have this right here so this spray nozzle you just shower blah, 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 and do all your thing and then you just always make sure that it's directed away from the leg with the cast all right now this is not going to work for everyone and of course you are dealing with an environment that is wet it's a hard surface and yes slipping is very possible so use extra caution but peeps that is how I've gotten it done. That is how the Lord God has pressed on my nefesh and given me the wisdom to get this done and not once has the cast gotten wet. So for that, I am absolutely grateful to the Lord God. Boom, that is the biggest tip I can help y'all out with and how I have managed to deal with the dreaded shower dilemma and the leg cast. All right, peeps. Well, I am off to go do a little bonus tip, so I'll return here directly. And uh, other than that, as always, find your walk with Yeshua through repenting and believing, and go love thy neighbor. Catch y'all soon.
What is up, peeps? Joshua here, and it is quick crutch tip time. So you're just out strolling around and enjoying some beautiful scenery on a glorious day the Lord God has made when <laughs> you have a clumsy moment like me and, oh, you drop your crutch. <laughs> Do you bend over and pick it up? Nah, just simply take your cast as such, take the crutch that's still in your hand, slot it in there, pick it up, and keep on crutching along. And that has been your crutch tip of the day. Y'all go love your neighbors.